Hello everybody and welcome along to the next episode of the two-player career mode featuring Team Marduk. Now, today is the Belgium Grand Prix and it's of course the famous Spa circuit, but there's a couple of big things happening. First of all, we've got lots and lots of upgrades due on the car, so fingers crossed we can get a number of them on for this race and really improve our performance. And also, we try and get a podium here today because if you haven't seen the last race yet, go check it out right now. We managed to win! What a race it was. We pushed so damn hard in Hungary that we need to keep following up with good results. And it's, and it's raised my expectations, possibly to impossible levels, but we want a podium today if possible. It's not going to be easy. Ben's McLaren is very, very fast. Our heart is not as fast as his, as well as the other cars at the front, the Ferrari in particular. But fingers crossed we can get a few upgrades on the car and be competitive today. Oh, hello, Sweat Lord. There's you. Takes a minute to find There's out. There's you. Done. Yeah, as predicted. Very good. Good comeback. Thank you for treating them to some content over the weekend. Yeah, did they enjoy that? I thought really they'd enjoy that. Really appreciate that. that. It, was my, it was my worst performing stream of about two years. So, um, <laughs> thank you. Oh, and, and also, you, so. in the 30 minutes you were on my rig, you managed to break two buttons on my wheel. Oh, yeah, that did happen. Yeah, that yeah that did happen. How are you going so rough? What's well, I was... I was... <laughs> Press the buttons. Let's see what the go faster button was. You're literally punching them. Right. Oh. Anyway, should we have a little look at the standings? Should we, should we treat ourselves to a little? Oh, oh, lovely stuff. Oh, I've had two wins in three races, mate. What's happened there? Three podiums in a row. Time to turn up the difficulty, mate. Well, I'm keen this race. What AI level do you want to run? 107. Yeah, I was thinking 107. No, Perfect. Not for, not, not for quality, but for the, oh. for the race. Well, I was, I was, I was easily on pole on 105 AI in in practice. I can do 106 for... Then we have to restart the session between thingies. Yes! Anyway, let's crack on then, guys. So there's my current facilities. Again, there's nothing I can do to control those, unfortunately. So we've got to hope that, that Haas starts to put some new ones on, particularly the powertrain department, so we can get that up to spec two. Um, we've got a major weight reduction and a minor ERS upgrade, both due on for Spa, but we've also got 1,930 ERS points still to spend. Now, obviously, oh, drag reduction. We'll have to rush it, though. Uh, drag reduction is going to be the one. What's after Spa? Zanvor. Zanvor's not a drag reduction circuit. Ben's, I saw from his video today, Ben's gone for DRS for this one. Yeah, I'm literally going to have to rush any upgrade to get them on, such as my poor facilities. Weight redistribution, I'm never that bothered about that one. We've got loads of weight reduction. The final one's the one going on soon. Tire wear, I've got enough of that. Don't need any of that. I think we rush on this drag reduction upgrade because we've been so insanely lucky this season that I feel like... There's almost, I literally almost feel like there's a glitch with, with two player career right now. The amount of luck we've got is absolutely outrageous. Like, mathematically outrageous. Uh, so I might rush that one on for 900 resource points. That'll hopefully go on time for Spa if we're lucky. We do still need some luck though. Maybe I do just wait and hope for the best and hope that I can sneak. Is it a major though? It is a minor, so it might sneak on in time. Oh, of course, we can't even rush it. Doesn't matter. Irrelevant. We can't actually rush the upgrades for, for the powertrain department because it's not spec 2. So we can't, we've got no chance of getting any, any ERS upgrade on. So the only other thing we could possibly get on for Spa would be DRS, just like Ben's got, which is very tempting. Where we rush a DRS upgrade and hope for the best. Again, the only reason I'm rushing so much is because we're an absolute statistical anomaly this season to the extent I feel like it's a bug that no upgrades ever fail in two-player career or something. Is it worth not doing one of those upgrades? Maybe not doing DRS and saving the points in case the ERS upgrade fails? I think I'm going to cancel that one, guys. We're going to keep the 1,000 resource points to guarantee that ERS upgrade goes on the car because we desperately need that. But yes, let's, let's crack on, guys. So in two days' time, we've got the major weight reduction and the minor ERS. We want both those on the car if we can. We'll look at the constructors quickly, actually. Ooh, lovely. Only 33 points back from McLaren now. Are you worried? No. Okay, good. Because I have a functioning teammate and you don't. <laughs> anyway, should we, uh, should we skip some time? Yes. I suppose we should. Let's go. Come on. Right. Green, 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 green. Yes! There's any definitely some sort of glitch. The There's got to be a glitch. We never fail anything. Now, can we also now sneak on that DRS upgrade, please? No, you see? This is what I mean. It, 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 we had two days leeway. We waited two days and suddenly it's not gone on the car. That's what I was worried about. We should have risked Alex? it. If we risked it, we'd have been okay, but we're not going to get it on the car. Yeah, I got a few upgrades coming. And what? What's it to you? Just wondering. <laughs> I have four upgrades on the way. Oh, lovely. I should have had four, but I went I went cautious, and now I'm maybe regretting it. <laughs> I think we just Very get the good. next one then, guys. It won't be on until... Why did we stop time? Did we get Monza, to be fair. Uh, no, no, no. I, I want ERS. ERS is my, my 
absolute priority right now. 380 as well. Time this year? Should we have a look at your uh, your R and D then? Oh, how did, did they now? That seems like a bit of a lie. But I had a bigger oh package my than you. God! Did you bring an ultimate? No, I brought a major, majors? major and two minors, and they're also super relevant what? for the circuit. What? I brought a major and three minors. Yeah, but you're a higher up team, so each upgrade for you will be worth less than mine. What are your thoughts on 107? No. Okay. Good. Very good. You don't want to get beaten by Ricardo, I see. Uh, so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the wing up by one more click. We go 7 4, and see how that feels. Take. We probably can't do two runs in this, so I'm not even going to try. We'll just do one lap run, and okay, it'll be the guys, best. It was alright on the out lap, at least. Good banker here. The other set of fields as well. It's okay. It was. It, it looked worse than it was. I think that definitely a little bit deep, a little bit loose on the X as well. But it was okay. So fast in a straight. Still being slightly hesitant through there. Not completely happy with the rear still. Just happy inside curve. Very cautious through there. Still not happy with the setup. I should have been showing you guys the temps. My bad. Not a bad lap this. Still not 100% happy with the setup. To be honest, I'm not even sure if it's any better than what it was in practice. It's, it's, it's just that through that chicane at the top of the hill, whatever that's called. Alonso's well, going to go quicker than me. See what I mean? The first time wasn't that bad before. I, I told you. We did a tenth down for it there. That felt better, but it wasn't. A bad turn to turn one at all last time. Okay, I'm actually going to go one click up on the front, but I'm going to go two clicks up on the rear, which is pretty. It's actually one click. I think I think that was the default. We're actually just, we're basically now running what we were in practice, but we're one click higher. All right, keep on that delta in the straights. I'm really squaring it off because that's what I did on that previous lap. Even though it felt slow, it was quick. Now, obviously, I've lost a bit of time there. Now, how much am I going to lose down this straight because of these higher wings? All oh, wide there, though. That's not ideal. Okay, I'd say I'm losing about a tenth down the straight. This straight. I fly just through right into the centre of my vision as I went through that corner. Whoa! <laughs> that was spicy. The car feels a bit better. It wasn't a great lap. Feels a bit better, but not much better. Well, one, one click further down on both of those. So 7-5. A bit, a bit quicker in the straights. A little bit slower in the corners, but a, a better balance front to rear, hopefully. Final lap of the session. Let's go. Let's see what we can do. Come on. Very nice through there. The previous run was good. And that was even better. Come on. Let's nail it this time. Let's get a good confident lap in. Carlos has gone pole. Again, not great through there. We're quite a long way up, though, somehow. Oh, that might be the setup, though. Oh my god, Ben's binned it. As if you binned it! Finish up a lap, though, hang on. Come on, guys. Three and a half tenths would be mega. This is Nick Reef from pole. If we can nail the final second, this might still be pole. Deep. Got the final turn a bit, but still a three and a half tenths game. That is not bad. Up to P5. We'll take that. We take that. That was not a bad last lap. Not bad. Not bad at all. Still not completely happy with the car, but I think that's going to have to do for the race. Oh, dear. Come on, then. What happened? I invalidated by a pixel. Oh, dear. I thought you were going to put in a rocket ship lap. I was. Well, why are you down a P12, then? Invalidation. Yeah. What about very, the other two runs? Very happy. <laughs> Really? I had a shout-out pole there. Definitely the time was in it, but I just, I'm just i not completely confident with the setup right now. A few little mistakes in that lap. Still found three and a half tenths, but I think realistically P4 was my maximum without somehow putting in the perfect lap with a setup I don't like. So, I have to do that. Ah, but yeah, you got a bit yeah. more downforce, which is just making your car that much more stable. I'm a bit worried. A bit worried. I don't but... know. I did, I did bin it. I wouldn't say it's stable. <laughs> Very good point. Can't say heaven to Ben, but any penalties? Ah, Ricardo didn't. Ah, uh, should be P5, I think. Any more penalties? Ah, uh, one. One. Oh, that can't be right. That's not. That's not factored in Ben's points. There's a clerk. The clerk had the penalty. 
We've had a rather P5 on the inside, but never mind. Uh, okay, so what are we going to do with these wings in the race? Yeah, Ben was right. We were on 7.5. I felt a lot more comfortable on 8.6. The car just felt more planted. And honestly, I think I need more the confidence for the race more than anything else, especially with tyres. 8.6, just a bit more downforce. Just to push into the track a little bit more. Should be able to run. Fairly light on fuel. Again, I'm not going to risk too much. I'm going to point three spare of fuel because that should be okay. Okay, halfway through the race, stop for hards. So that's what the AI will do-ish. Or we could run long and go soft. I don't like that strategy there. The tyre wear is probably too high. Unless we get halfway through the race and our tyres are chilling at like 40% wear. Maybe even a bit less. Then we're like, okay, let's do it, I reckon. And only though, I am on... I, that grid penalty has put me on the outside for turn one instead of on the inside. So oh, I, you poor thing. I might rather you, not you have move, it. You move up a position and you're still complaining. Alex Gillen is never truly satisfied. Uh, where's Gasly going? Oh my god, he's going around again. Oh, uh, is he going to keep going round and round? Oh. oh. There we go, okay. right, good luck. Good luck. Oh god. He's had very sharply. That's not a line that the uh, real players would take on the start. Lost a little bit off the start there, but let's see if we can make it back with our low wings. Don't go side by side, guys. Oh, thank god for that. I think get a good run through there because it's a bit scared of them being side by side. But let's see if we can get a good run on them here without low wings. Oh no. Oh, I'm going to squeeze alongside them. Let's see if we get up to P3. It's going to be scary. Oh, guys. What are you doing? Perez needs to back out there. What? What has happened there? Are you out? No, I'm still alive. I might take my restart card though. AI is so bad. You're bad. Oh, Perez should have backed out. I'm taking my restart card. My one restart, restart card. God's sake. AI is so bad. Perez must have been like just barely a wing alongside my wheel and just kept his foot in. Slowed everybody down. And then Verstappen was alongside me. I don't really know what happened. I feel like he maybe jerked to the right. I don't know. And then my front just hit him and he just spun me into the wall. Yeah, well, we both used our restart cards now. One, one of the season. Which I think is quite a good way of doing it. So if we if we bid it again here, that's it. You just got to carry on. Uh, Come on then, guys. I don't know if it's because it's Verstappen as well, maybe not backing out, but let's have a better start. Come on. Oh, that wasn't a bad start until we got the secondary wheel spin. Side aside for a rouge. It's bad news for us. Good news for Ben. Oh, are they going to sort it out? Oh, go away, Hamilton. That's not the time or the place. Oh, how many can we gain here? Still have a great run through there. I just I don't want to send it anymore. It's too risky. Oh, Ferrari's so slow on that apex. What the hell? There's been side by side for most of the lap, but I don't want to get taken out again. Oh, still side by side. Look how much we're losing from the leaders. Get on with it, guys. Oh, they lift in there. Why are they lifting there, dude? I mean, I've got to send it at some point. I can't just sit behind Together, the whole time. Man. Okay, finally got them done. Ah, for sake, right. Oh, what the frick? Go head down now. <laughs> oh my god, Ben's just been whoopsie, does he? Um, well, you know are you out? BSC, are you out? I'm out. What happened? I'm just driving in a straight line and Hamilton has jinked right. I told you, they're weirdly aggressive at Spa. They've been ultra aggressive today. I don't know why. Whoa, aren't you taking out as DC? I've just been taken out as well. It must be DC. Let's restart again then. Right, good luck. Let's be very cautious with the AI. Yeah, yeah good luck. Come on, let's actually get a race start in here, shall we? Trying a better start if we can, but I just suck at them. Oh! Really? What is this AI? Fair damage. 
You got damage? Yeah. <laughs> I actually survived. They just sent it on me in turn one. Right, right as tight to the inside. It just spun me round, half spin. And then stuck to me. Would you like another restart? Yes. We may as well at this point. <laughs> Let's just keep going all night. So we both get a perfect start and we're one two after first lap, okay? Alright, come on guys. Uh, good luck. Good work. Give the bid, no restarts. Okay, yeah, good luck. Let's please make it through this time. Come on, we got this. Come on, guys. That was close. Maybe we'll very nearly turned into me. Luckily, the last second he started against it. Can we get the slap and... Oh, the slap's going to go slap aside. Slap's gonna go three wide. Let's hope he doesn't. Any room given? Yeah, a little bit. Okay, we pulled off an overtake against the AI guys. We're up to P3. It's our best start of the lot, thankfully. Whoa, he sent it there! What are they doing today? I saw it coming, luckily, he gave him some room. Luckily, I gave him room, because that could have been drama. Actually, okay. I had that in career mode too. Alonso sends it from like three tenths back. I had to dive out of the way to not get taken out. Massive flashbacks available. This happens quick right now, guys. He's very quick. Luckily, we're quick in a straight line, so we should be able to oh, stay away from him, hopefully. Okay, up to P3 as well. Like I said, that was actually our best start of all the starts we had. I'm not at all upset that this is the one that's worked out. Then we have here. Just try and get in slipstream range of the cars ahead. We've got low wings. So I don't really want any confidence in the car. Those restarts have not helped. Happens not getting too much on us, you know. We'll have more downforce than us and higher wing settings than us. We'll be quick, but if we can keep away a bit, we can stay out of the drama. She's a bit of ERS here. I promise I'm burning ERS when I'm doing this, but I'm just trying to stay in the ERS range of the cars in front. That is going to be huge. Pretty good through there against the AI. Okay, I'm going fast enough the race. We'll like to see. We can hopefully save some ERS now. We've got the ERS. Yeah, lifting through there and through Poo on, interestingly. That was flat for me that time. Gaining a bit of confidence with the car, bit by bit. Okay, overall that's a bit better. Slight big gap to the staff than we had this time last lap. He's going to be RS here once again, just to guarantee us getting in that DRS range. That should be fine, because we're quicker in a straight line. I'd love to get the staff in that DRS range, but I don't think it's going to be possible. Not like burning all the way RS, we haven't got much. There's Ben. Ben's still in the lowly points, but he's doing alright. Now, problem is we're still burning ERS. The ERS charge is going down. It's a bit of a worry. But later in the race. And Ben's got better ERS systems than us now, so he should be able to save more ERS than we are. I'll we'll try to get out of dirty air there on the apex of turn, but it caused me to understeer so much on the exit. As little ERS as I possibly can while staying in DRS range. But now inside a second, I think they lift through here, do they? And they might slightly lift still through there. I think a bit closer than he was last lap, because he didn't use any ERS, but it should be okay. Let's try to bit there, let's be careful. He's still lifting through there, I think it might be. Fortunately, Sainz still not able to make an impression on Ricardo yet, but he, I think he is closing in slightly. Our teammate's holding Ben up, which is lovely. Now, I should have better tyre wear than these guys, I think. I seem to have in Hungary anyway. Whether that was set up like, specific to Hungary or... I've got quite a few tyre wear upgrades as well, so you think I will genuinely should have better tyre upgrades. A bit wide there, okay, just... So good through there still. G'day. Hello. Oh, well, that doesn't sound very encouraging. <laughs> It's a bit sweaty up here, mate. Very sweaty. What position are you in? P9. Yeah, I got yeah. stuck in a DRS train, and then your teammate in Alonso started battling a lot. Ah, oh, glad he finally got that letter I've been sending him for weeks. Fancy a bit closer to Ricardo to you. Uh, might lose DRS here, he's in L turn one. Could be close, could be close, I think we're okay. Just, but we did have to run a bit more ERS. I, did, I, have, I have been recharging tiny bit the last couple of laps, which is encouraging, but not by much. Getting more and more confidence each lap the pass is, but it's not easy to stick with these guys. Not at all. Okay, I'm just going to pray my tyres towards the end of this stint. Are we going to come into their own? My tyre wear upgrades. Now, can we not use the ERS down this straight? We might be able to get away with it. So, again, DRS. It's very marginal, though. We've got to try and manage this. I'm trying to just recharge my ERS while managing these gaps. Not easy. Not easy at all. We could do this one stop to softs. We don't have to copy the AI and go hards. Doesn't appear to be getting any easier with tyre wear. That being said, we are saving more ERS than we were at the start of the race. At the start of the race, we were burning it like crazy stick with them. Okay, we're a touch closer to the car ahead now. 
the tenth quick and tenth close than well last straight. Oh, got away a bit. Bit of a lock up there, but I managed to mask it, turning a bit earlier, extending the breaker zone slightly. I'll try not burning any OS down this straight as well, so a bit closer again. Another sweaty way, it's just like hungry, but wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> oh, be careful I turn it. If I, if, I, if I turn it aggressively there, I will spin. I have to be careful. This happens close, but I hope my wings will keep him at bay, even if he's burning ERS. Signs is almost out of DRS range, but not quite. We're okay. We gain about 10% ERS that lap as well. We're still saving it. Signs is about to drop out of DRS range of Ricardo. I think Ricardo might have this one, but I thought also thought that in Hungary. Very close to our first trap this morning. What we're trying to do is get to above 90% ERS charge, and then we can start chilling. Oh, yellow flag. Who's that? Oh, Signs. Oh, that's annoying. Signs in the bin. That was my that was my, uh, my my train conductor, my train driver. Got a push. I've got to give it my all. So I've taken a few risks. So much more grip now, though. Early on the power. Oh, don't need that. I've got lots of ERS here. Pray. Ricardo's not doing the same. Six tenths is a lot in one straight, but we're very quick in a straight line. ERS makes a massive difference as well. Already got half of it. If he lifts through here, it'll be close. I think we maybe got it. We need to keep pushing hard, though. Even if we did get it, which we did, we need to get it again. That's the next one that's more important. This zone's... Oh, lots of wheel spin. This zone's quite short. Slap and boxing. No! Oh, we missed it by a hundredth! We missed it by a hundredth! Ricardo must have burnt a little bit. Oh, no, we got it! We still got it! I have no idea how we got that. I swear we were outside of it. Okay, they're boxing now. They're going to be in some traffic. But Slappen's in bad traffic. So they'll be boxing this lap. The traffic will only be for one lap. I think we box, guys. I think we just... Copy their strat. We go well. There's no point in taking a risk, is there, in trying to get to softs? So it would be a big risk anyway. We're already at 50% tire wear. Try to be as close as I can to Ricardo. See what happens. He might he might get held up by Red Bull in the pits. Actually, no, he won't cause because Red Bull's before him in the pits. Did not need that. Make sure we've got hards selected. We have hards. Not a bad pit in that. Come on. We've got half a chance of this. Of this, of this win, we need to make sure we stay in DRS range of Ricardo, though he's not going to get held up in the pits at all. We need a good stop here from the boys. We had a bad stop last time. We need a good one here. Perfect. That was good. That was good. Looks like we gained on Ricardo. It's still in DRS range. How is Verstappen still here? With all that traffic he got on his outlap. He's still here. Oh my god. That's not good news. I thought it was going to be just me and Ricardo in this battle now. Right, we now need to stick with Ricardo, who's a faster driver, I believe, than the Ferrari. Like oh no. What's this issue? We don't need an ERS issue now. That could be disastrous. Not at this point in the race. It's a very sensitive point in the race. ERS might get locked on. Go to take ERS. Should we get a lot harder to drive? Oh, don't tell me that's the understeer issue, dude. Don't tell me. We've got it again, man. I get it so. Oh, it is. So often, man. Why do I get it all the time? It's the worst bug. Oh dear. It doesn't feel we disastrous really to us. We don't really need downforce of this track. We've already shedded it off anyway. Yeah, it might be okay. Okay, the understeer issue is not too bad. We're not going to get a win from here, guys, with this understeer issue. We might be able to get P2, though. The understeer issue, guys, really isn't that bad, which says to me, this issue is linked to wing level. It's not that bad. It is more understeer because we've now probably got the same, if not less, grip than those very used mediums. But we're running very low rings. Whereas on tracks we run very high wings, it makes a much bigger difference because we've got, oh, such a high wing. I think Max tried to go on the outside of me there. Now, it normally makes a much bigger difference to this. I've had it cost me two, three seconds a lap. I never really understood why it was variable amount. Now I do. It's linked to wing level. You know what? I wouldn't mind it so much if it gave you a massive straight line speed advantage. I'm like, okay, well, I'd rather have the setup that I chose. But actually, if the, let's say it's the front wing adjuster that breaks and it forced you to zero wing, that's okay because I'll, I'll be rapid in a straight line. We can still bring home P2 here, guys, which will be a huge result. It's not quite a win, especially with Ben's teammate taking that win. Let's throw in a straight line. Oh, God, that's very deep. Let me break up my normal point. I have to break it early, of course, with less front down force. Oh, dude! That was... Stick a wing in through there. I just had to hold my line of hope for the best. Somehow he backed out of it. We didn't crash. That could have been me out of the race. The yellow, that's what. Oh, no! What's happened? You're out. Oh my god. And my teammate! What have you done to him? 
Oh, there's a huge pileup. There's a huge pileup. What's going on? That's gonna be a safety car, surely. Nothing was going my way there. How is this not a safety car, please? Uh, BSC. What the hell just happened, please? Oh, Whoa, how, many, how many people crashed out there? So many. Count them, I don't know, but there was a lot. Yeah, the car was not feeling good. Guys, I would I would box for softs if we had this understeer so, issue. As it so is, light. I need to see the whole position. Yeah, well, up, so if it goes out better for you. Yeah, probably, because it means I can burn more ERS effectively. So could they, obviously, but... I probably will need the ERS to defend. I'm, I pray I can get up into the lead. There's, def there's a definite chance, but I will get one chance. All right, come on. My tyres should be fresh at theirs now, I think. Okay, can we look after tyres better than the safety car than the AI can? Lovely restart, lovely, lovely restart. Not going to go for it here, I'm going to wait. He's going to be quick and straight though, and he's hoping he lifts for a rouge. It's not very close, the exit was poor. They're so, look how quick he is, what the hell? Wow, second lift there as well. It's very bumpy up through there at the moment. Can we get him here? It's going to be close. Lots and lots of ERS being used. We need to get to the inside as well because we've got the understeer. Don't forget, is he going to let us have the inside line? Oh, he is just. Uh, he's going back out of it at some point. I'm pretty sure that was my corner. That was definitely my yeah. corner. Can't do overtakes without making contact. <laughs> Fuck the bus! Oh no! Trying? Why has Perez come through? Why is that a yellow flag? Someone's binned it. Uh, I asked him about it. It was my corner! He can get the bin! Even if they can let you go, for some reason they always fight me. Oh god. Because you never leave them space. You, you lock up, you go way too deep into a corner. Oh, nice oh. oh hello. Nice I've much preferred Ricardo chasing me than a Red Bull. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, it wasn't the cleanest of moves, guys, but it's for a race win. I've got to go for it. It was my corner. Right, in real, we're all in real life, and we're all witnessing in real life, that would be my corner. The Alex Dillon treatment of the AI. No, we arrest need done that straight, guys. That's fantastic news. Let's go hold these apexes, guys. Hold the apexes. Don't let them through. Defend when I need to. They're quick into here. Oh, Ricardo, don't do that. Oh, why has he done that? No, I wanted him. The Red Bulls are way quicker in a straight line. Ricardo is easy in a straight line. I, I, I don't know if I'd rather Ricardo P2 in an easy win or Ricardo in the mud so you get less points. I don't know. Start the side again. Yeah, DRS is enabled. Oh, God. Hello. Get in the slip screen, mate. Keep my back. He's in the mud. Wait, he's not using barely any overtake. Oh, no. That means he's going to go full seven on the last lap. I could be in trouble. Oh, there's no grip. Come on, though. This will be an incredible win with this issue. Go away, Perez. No, thank you. 25%. Chill on tyres. Of all places to go deep. Why there? Why? <laughs> Come on! Are they lifting through there? They might be. Yeah, they are lifting through there. Why? They're lifting through poo on. Oh, blotch one as well. Oh my god, he's oh. definitely burning more ERS now though. Oh. Stay away. 50% I've still got. Say, so, GG. Yep, yeah, pulled yeah. it. No, why? Why? Ricardo was in P3. He just gained three points on the last lap. I had Perez under control, I got 50% ERS. I would rather oh, Perez by me. Oh, hold on. on. Go away, Ricardo. He's eating his ERS as well. Oh, my. Go away. Go Big away. Time. Stay Come away. On. You should be in P3. You're lucky, Ricardo. You're so bad. Let's go, baby. Another win. <laughs> as if I've just cheesed that race after all those restarts. <laughs> that is. From the highs of the last win, that was not up there. I'm not going to lie. I'll take it. <laughs> As if we cheese that win, guys. Wow. Uh, like I said, it's not my proudest win. It's not my finest moment. But we take it. We take it. A win's a win. We had to drive well, especially with the issue at the end there. Ben's out. We gained 25 points. Unfortunately, we only gained 7 points on McLaren, though. So I'm a bit annoyed about that. Ricardo could have been in the mud. That could have been a huge swing. Have a look at the constructors. Oh, I'm up to P5 now. Overtaken both Alpine and Aston. 26 behind, points behind McLaren now. Don't have to worry yet. Clap the AI are. <laughs> the TV got fastest lap. In a Williams. Alright, did he box at the end for softs then? Probably. Yeah, yeah it's in softs.
Oh my god. As with the understeer issue as well. Let's see how much it was costing me. So I had it on that out lap, I think. Yeah, so with 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 fresh hards, I was four, five tenths slower in the middle sector than on used very used mediums. And they were definitely quicker. Alright, well, that'll give you a week to uh, do a bit of practice, mate, and uh, buck up your ideas. Good. You got See a then. genuine chance to win the race next time, mate. I do have sympathy for him, because it is race went terribly. We had loads of restarts. It was, it was a terrible race. Like I said, that win for me, a win's a win, but it doesn't feel great. The win last week, last time, felt amazing. Real, deserved, pushed hard, grinded for it, and, and earned it. Thank you so much for joining me today. Another win. It doesn't feel as, as elated as the last win, but as I said, um, you know, we take those. It is what it is. Um, I was in contention anyway, so uh, yeah. I mean, bit of a weird one. Ben sound as dejected as ever, bless him. But I genuinely do think Ben has got a, a good chance ne next season. I'm not just trying to say that to hype up the series or to make Ben feel better. Genuinely, as Ben was saying, their car is draggy and high downforce compared to mine. Zanvor, that's exactly what you want. There's not many straights in Zanvor, not really. Um... Draggy is what you want, really. You want high wings there. So Ben will have a great chance there. I genuinely think Ricardo will be on pole position if Ben's not. I think that McLaren will be on pole um, unless I could do something magical, which I don't think we've got any upgrades, so I don't think I can. Um, so I do genuinely think Ben could bounce back, and I think he can get at least a podium, if not his first race win at the next race in Zanfor. As I said, though, that won't be for just over a week. I'm at Reading Festival this weekend, which I'm going to enjoy on there from Thursday to Monday. So uh, the next stream of this two-player career series will be next Tuesday, one week and one day from now, Tuesday the 30th, uh, at the same time, at the same place, 6 p.m. UK time, right here on Facebook Gaming. Have a nice guys. Thank you, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.